Hey guys, and welcome back to FedEx Gaming, and if you realize lately I haven't been doing any redstone tutorials. Now, a while back, well, not too long ago, I said I was going to be a little slow on my redstone tutorials since I started working on redstone manor again. So I thought, well, since I'm not going to be putting a redstone tutorial up, I might as well put a video up on what I've done on redstone manor so far so you guys at least know I'm trying to do something here. I'm not trying to just, I'm not like, oh, I'm just going to take a week off and go bleh, whatever. But so I decided to make a little video on what I've done on Redstone Manor in the past few days. So here we go. So far I have done the outer shell of the building. I haven't done like any of like the windows or the interior and all that. So right now this is just an out outer shell. This is just a blank canvas for the artist to paint on. I am not an artist. I am not a painter. I'm just making references here. But I also put in the little board of what you have to do like with the rules and uh, created by blah 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 blah. The back has the score like the scoring how to beat the game side quest blah 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 the scoreboard is here and this board right here is for uh people who join up my world before i actually put it up for download so yes i will be letting people into this world to come check it out and then you will get your name up there and you'll it'll be on there forever and ever and ever so like i said so far i've gotten this whole out outer exterior done i've gotten this little building done over here this is the only thing with something in it right now and i got like a little tiny uh <laughs> parking lot here i'm gonna make it a little bigger i'm gonna make it go out more this way i'm gonna have some fake houses and man i really i really i wish i had someone helping me on this thing i i don't want people to help me though because one i kind of want to do it on my own and two i'm a little afraid that someone's gonna grief me and mess up some of the redstone and i'm gonna have to go back and fix stuff but, but i'm gonna have to like bring the land out all the way out there because when you're up there when you're all the way up top you could see out and i don't want to see this i don't want to see this when you're up here Let's go up here. Let's say I have a room up here or something. I don't want to be able to see that. You see that right there? Where my cur my uh, crosshair is? So I want to bring that out far, far enough so people can't see. And then I'm going to put trees everywhere or just fake building like prop buildings and stuff like that. I, I really don't even know what I'm going to do with the interior of, the interior of this whole building. Because most of this stuff takes place underground. So I'm trying to think of what I'm going to be doing inside there in the first place. Because I know on the scoreboard you're going to need to find diamonds and you're going to need to find gold nuggets and stuff like that and all that good stuff. So I might hide most of the gold nuggets and diamonds inside the building itself. But I don't know, really know how much redstone I'm going to be doing inside this building. So let me just show you what I've done. So far I've gotten, like I said, I got the building up and, and I got part of the stampy easter egg done. So hold on one second. <clears throat> I'm going to show you the part of the stampy easter egg that I got done. The stampy easter egg starts right in the beginning of the map. But it's the last Easter egg you can get to. It starts in the beginning, but it's the last one you can do. It's weird. So you got to press this button here. Because we got to open up these main doors right here. These are the two computer rooms that open up the, the door. Here's another button. That will open up this door. And right here is where the Stampy Easter egg begins. This is where the Stampy Easter egg begins. So we go in here. We got a nice little uh, RI that stands for Redstone Ink. No, this is not a Boston Red Sox thing. <laughs> I was thinking of the Red Sox when I was making it. I'm not even a Red Sox fan, but I was like, uh, so I threw an I next to it just so people don't go, is this guy a Boston Red Sox fan? But yeah, so you got to start the Stampy Easter egg, you got to click this button down here, which opens up the pillar door that I made a tutorial on. <laughs> Has a little thing right here. It's going to have a, it's going to have a sign in here with some like wording like who left this cake, yada, yada, yada. We must find blah, 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 all that good stuff. So then we click this button right here. And then we got to go back to the beginning where I showed that one door and that door opens up. It's a triple, uh, I mean a 3x3 flush hidden door. I have a tutorial on this too. So then we go all the way down here, all the way down here. And it starts here, the Stampy Easter egg. Now, if you are a Stampy <laughs> subscriber, then you already know what this place is. You should know what this place is. But to start this, it starts here. But the reason why you need it to start here you don't have to do this part but the reason why you need it is to get to the final part inside the easter egg you'll go into the easter egg but every easter egg usually has another part inside the easter egg that you need to find so the way this works is right here if you notice is a button click this and you get a dog now you gotta you can leave either you can train the dog with the bone you, you have to get the dog and uh, you can either, you can decide to leave the dog here and then come back for it when you get to the Easter egg or you can bring it around with you. I would prefer leaving the dog here so in case it doesn't die or something along the way. 
but you need the dog at the end for uh, to get into his Easter egg for his last part of his Easter egg which I haven't started his Easter egg yet but I already have the complete idea of what I want to do for it and I think it's gonna come out really nice but yeah guys so that's all I really that's what I've done so far on uh, Redstone Inc or Redstone Manor it was it was supposed to be Redstone Manor it was supposed to be a mansion but then I changed it to be a gigantic corporation building and there's just a big conspiracy behind it and all that stuff but yeah that's all I've really done so far but I mean I'm working on this by myself and I'm also doing my other videos and I'm playing games and I got school and I got work and I got all that so I try to find as much time well I guess I don't find enough time to do this but yeah I got the whole exterior out all well, the whole uh yeah pretty much exterior done but now I got to bring this land all the way out as far as the eye can see literally as far as the eye can see because like I said if you're up here and there's a window here that means I got to bring the land out all the way over to there <laughs> which is going to be a pain it's going to be a pain in the butt but like I said I don't think I could trust people that well I'm not I'm not a very good person at trusting people all right guys so that's what I've done so far in Redstone Manor I hope you enjoyed this little update on it if you did leave it a like and subscribe to stay tuned with my newest videos all right guys peace